If you haven't heard of the Wild yet, chances are you soon will. They're the Kiwi band making some serious waves internationally. One of their songs was just used for McDonald's Sochi Olympics campaign, and they've recently topped Spotify's viral charts in the US. Welcome, Joe, Mo, and Brandon. Hello. Good yeah, morning. Chances are, that's true, isn't it? That we're all going to be hearing your name very, very soon. You guys are doing amazing things. Yeah, no, it's very, uh, it's very exciting times there. Eh? Yeah. Shall we, before we actually kick into to finding out what it is that you're doing, let's just have a look at the track that, that McDonald's used at the, at the Sochi Olympics. Okay, so that's the song, that's the lyric video, but McDonald's picked up on that and, and used it for the, for the Winter Olympics campaign. Yeah, How does yeah. that even happen? Um, well, we were just sitting at McDonald's one day, you know, and just like uh, singing our song and then... <laughs> no. <one> of it. <laughs> <laughs> no um, yeah, like we used, uh, our manager sort of sent the song to one of the uh, supervisors and at this point they had already, they'd already chosen a song for the campaign. Yeah. Which was sort of like a somber piano-esque type thing and um, a week out from releasing and they, uh, they decided to go with our one. Which is really cool for us because it's very different for them to use something like uh, Absolutely. Our, our, our song. Mm. And what does that mean for you guys in terms of exposure? I mean, oh, it was huge. crazy in the states because um, I basically started playing everywhere. Like, oh, my friends would keep sort of messaging me on WhatsApp or uh, Facebook saying, "Hey, I just saw your the ad you're in." Um, but it was playing everywhere, like prime time, a few thousand times. Yeah. yeah, I kept getting Facebook messages from my mom because they're based in the states. And uh, she'd be like, oh my gosh, we just saw you. You're on NBC, you're on ESPN. We just saw your minute-long commercial on, on uh, NBC. And I was just like... And then it was, we're sick of seeing you. We're sick of seeing you. <laughs> it's uh, enough it was, now. It was, yeah. it was great, yeah. So, so who's um, been in touch since? I mean, has this sort of opened more doors? Yeah, well, I mean, so like, yeah, the, the Spotify thing happened and iTunes charting and all that. And so there's been, you know, a lot of sort of label attention, which is great. And... Um, a lot of people have been in touch. It's yeah, been, and because the Spotify, you, you've topped Spotify's final charts. Yeah, it was like top three. Who did yeah, you beat yeah. out for that? Uh, Never Ray, Ray, apparently. <laughs> it's quite cool. Stop it. Yeah. Um, yeah. But it's just, I think it's just really cool for us that people are using like Shazam to to Google us and and see what the song from McDonald's is, is yeah. because it's just so different to what they normally do musically. Joe, how did you guys all get together? How did you meet? Um, we, well, Mo and I met at university. Mm -hmm. We were studying architecture together. And then we met Brandon through Mo's brother. So just at university was as well. architecture going to be the career, was it? Um, <laughs> originally <laughs> for us too. I, yeah. I mean, it still is. This is just fun time. <laughs> uh, <laughs> do you need any? No, uh, no, Who's uh, the stand-up uh, comedian? One of you. You. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <Funny> yes. <that. laughs> yeah. <laughs> you do a little bit of that in your downtime as well? That's, yeah, it's a hobby. Is it? Yeah, I stopped. Uh, stopped uh, I, I bombed once. And <laughs> <laughs> that must be a hideous moment. Really? Yeah. Do you think that Lord has um, has changed it up a bit in terms of her massive success last year and continuing success in, in terms of just people noticing Kiwi bands and what we're doing? I, I definitely think there's a bit of a spotlight going yeah, on in New Zealand. There's definitely music, more attention. Uh, right now, for sure. Um, and a lot of respect as well. Like, I yeah. mean, if, if now, nowadays, if someone hears you from New Zealand and says, like, oh, oh, really? Okay, okay. Yeah. So, Lord yeah. of the Rings, Lord. It's, yeah. Well, no, it, it's interesting because it's almost like Swedish pop. Like, people think, oh, you know, Sweden's really good for pop music. Yeah. But like, they've kind of got like a thing going. And so now I feel like New Zealand's kind of moving into that. Because how would, how would you describe your music? You know, if people put titles on you in terms of, um, of your sound? I wouldn't want to. Um, uh, um, I don't know, it's just alternative. Uh, Alternative hip hop, maybe. Right. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. And you know, we we saw the the, the lyric video video for that song. When, when are you gonna actually shoot the real one? What's, what's what happens there? Uh, we're currently uh, we've just shot a bunch of stuff in Qatar. Right. Um, wow. Why yeah. here? Uh, it's like because uh, like my, uh, my my brother lives there, who's okay. sort of like um, helping to shoot it and direct it and everything. Ooh. And uh, it's just like a really amazing. It's like the fa it's an amazing place, the fastest growing country in, on the planet. You know, and just all these deserts and we used horses and film cameras and well, it's just going from strength to strength because I know there's tours booked in the UK and the US as well and yeah. got all that going. Shows, oh yeah. you so do please festivals, if, yeah. if you have time do come back don't forget us we had you here first oh girl you know we've <laughs> back. yeah no of course good luck you guys thank you so much thanks thank you so much